Hey guys, it's Jennifer here. Welcome to my video. If you are new here, please go ahead and click that subscribe button down below and that notification bell so that you don't miss any time that I upload. It's Saturday today and so pretty much on the agenda I have a grocery haul planned. I'm not sure if we are going to go get groceries ourselves or if I'm going to place an online order. I need to um, figure out what my meal plan is as well. I did get myself a Christmas present. Well all my Christmas presents for myself were from myself just FYI. But I bought the new, well not the new, I bought a Skinny Taste cookbook, the one and done. And I'm going to look through that and see if I can't find a new recipe or two to try out and then figure out, you know, what two dinners that we're going to have this week so that I can figure out what I want to do for groceries. But um, my daughter and her whole family and everybody has been moving in. So we have lots of new little animals in the house. Um, I may take you around in a little while and show them to you just so that you can meet everybody. So now there are um nine animals in the house because we have five and they have four but we do kind of have them separated we have an old house so there's kind of like the front part and the back part so that does kind of help out so everybody is kind of separate um and still kind of has their own little space so it's working out very well but anywho i'm gonna go ahead and i guess get my cookbook out and figure out what we want to eat this week because right now i really don't know after all of the christmas food and everything um I don't know what I'm wanting so I'm gonna look and see if we want to do I'm sure we'll probably do maybe like a slow cooker meal and you know either some kind of sheet pan meal or something like that so I will let you know once I get my groceries I'll go over my meal plan at that point okay guys we finally have our grocery pickup done we decided to go with the Publix Instacart today before I go through the groceries let me just tell you my meal plan so I'm gonna do one new meal for y'all and then one repeat meal because I've kind of been craving an Asian meal so we're gonna do our Kung Pao chicken with the Asian fried rice made from cauliflower rice and the uh, stir fry vegetables which I did forget to add stir fry vegetables to my order so we are gonna have to pick those up which I think we're gonna make a Sam's Club run after this so hopefully I will have another uh, Sam's Club haul to include in this video with you but we will see and then the second um, recipe that I'm gonna make is gonna be a new one so I got myself a Christmas present this week and it is a uh, one of the skinny taste cookbooks and this is the one and done i saw it at target the other day and i wanted to go ahead and pick it up and i know i can find most of these recipes online actually one of the recipes i've already made for y'all is in here i do just love a real book i don't know if y'all are that way or not but i love something about a real cookbook so this week we are going to make vegetarian butternut chili because my daughter and her family are staying with us they are vegan so that is one meal that they can eat as well and along with that i will make my corn muffins so anyway, I just wanted to show you my cookbook because I love it and I'm excited to try new recipes from that. So that's why I chose that to pick a recipe from this week. So let's just jump into these groceries. I just have them sitting here in no particular order. So we will just do produce first. So I got bananas. Of course, I have a banana every day. I love those. Zero points on the blue plan. I got three bell peppers. I got two green and a red. I still have one yellow left from last week. Um, so I didn't get any yellow. They ended up giving me extra ones last week on the yellow because at Publix, I forget, for some reason these are like one each priced and the other ones are a pound and I put in one and so I got a pound of yellow peppers last week. But anyway, I got two greens and one yellows this week. I did pick up one lime because we need, I think, one or two tablespoons of lime juice for that uh, butternut squash chili. Uh, I got a tomato, which is a tiny little tomato for my sandwich, but at least it looks ripe. The one that I got last week was green whenever we cut into it. We had to go to the store and get a new one. So you just never know with produce. That's the one bad thing with the uh, grocery pickup, in my opinion. Uh, I got my blueberries, which these look pretty good this week. I was happy with that. And then, of course, I got my cantaloupe. And I got my pineapple also. So we need four cups of butternut squash for the... Uh, butternut squash chili that we're making, which I got two bags of this. Um, and I am gonna increase the serving size of the recipe. So I'm really not sure if this is enough. I don't know if you can tell, but 
this is only halfway full, which I never really know how big these bags are. So when we go out, we are probably going to have to pick up another bag of this. I'm hoping that Sam's Club will have something and then we will see. But if, you know, Sam's Club has a huge bag and we can use that, then we can save these for another time. They are frozen, so they will keep. And then I got two boxes of these uh, spring rolls that we like to have as a side with our Kung Pao chicken. And I think that is all of the frozen food that I got. Uh, for lunch this week, I will be going back to having my sandwiches just like normal. I got my Boar's Head Oven Roasted Turkey Breast. And then I got a thing of the Arnold's Sandwich Thins that I eat my sandwiches on. And then for my husband, I did pick him up one of the Boar's Head uh, Italian Sandwiches that he likes to slice up and take for his lunch. And I got another thing of the Chobani Non-Fat Greek Yogurt. Y'all know I love this. I have this with my fruit every day. I got two things of the unsweetened almond milk, and then I also got two containers of egg whites for my breakfast. Even though if we go to Sam's Club, I'll probably pick up one of their big packs because it's such a good price, but I did go through quite a few egg whites. I got two cartons of eggs because I've used almost all of my eggs that I had in the house during the holidays. And then... I got a thing of half and half for my husband. This is what he uses for his coffee. When I make my corn muffins, I'm going to make them with the unsweetened applesauce instead of using the egg whites so that the vegans in the house will eat those as well unless they don't care if egg whites are in it, but we will see about that. But I went ahead and picked up some unsweetened applesauce and Athena can eat it as well for a snack. I did get two things of laundry detergent. These are buy one, get one free. I always do that at Publix. Look, they, every week they usually have some kind of laundry detergent. Buy one, get one free. It's either Purex All or mm, sometimes they'll do Arm & Hammer. I won't get the Arm & Hammer. That's not one of my favorite brands. But anyway, I always love the buy one, get ones. I got a thing of uh, vegetable broth. This is for the chili. And then it also called for just a 14-ounce can of the diced tomatoes, but I went ahead and got the larger can since I'm going to try to bulk up the recipe. And then I got a thing of my Prego pizza sauce. You know, I love this one. It's one point for a serving that I use when I make my pizzas. I got a couple of cans of black beans. I probably will use three cans. I know I've got one or two cans of black beans in the cabinet, and so we will use those for the recipe as well. And then it also called, and I've never used this. This is chipotle peppers in adobo sauce. I think it needs two or three tablespoons of that, so I got this can of this, and I really don't know what to expect this to taste like, but it sounds interesting, the butternut squash and this, and um, just everything else that's in there, the diced tomatoes, the, and I think the seasonings it calls for is cumin, which I know I love, salt and pepper, and then the chili powder, I think. Um, I can't remember exactly everything, but... I am excited to try that recipe, and I think that's all the groceries that I got at Publix. So I'm going to get these put away real quick, and then we will have a Sam's Club haul for you, hopefully. Now that I'm looking back, I can see all the signs I tried to fill. here is our Sam's Club haul. We have not gotten it out of the back of the car yet, but Charlie's going to move this thing right here, and then I'm just going to show you the cat litter and waters and stuff because we will not be taking those into the house. But we did get three things of the 44-pound cat litters, and we got three cases of water and a case of paper towels. Those will not make it in the house. Um, we do keep a lot of stuff out here in the garage, but I just thought that I would give y'all a little peek at this. I think everything else we will bring in. We have this tote that we keep in the back of the car. It really comes in handy. And then this box to put stuff in. So both of those will go in and we will just show you everything real quick on the counter. We're going to lay it all out. But I'll show you my stash here in the garage real quick so you can see. So we have like extra toilet paper that I usually order from Amazon. And then I've got like my Premier Protein shakes and stuff, extra wipes. I always have tons of laundry detergent. Like I said, every time Publix has them, buy one, get one free. If I go there, I get those. That's just some miscellaneous items. 
and then we've got paper towels and some more toilet paper and stuff up there as well so we try to stay pretty stocked around here and then this is my refrigerator in the garage and we keep just extra drinks and water pretty much this is all drinks i think extra milks extra egg whites all of that stuff so anyway we, we're pretty stocked and okay guys here we're going to go through the sam's club haul real quick so we got a big pack of chicken breasts that's one thing i forgot to add to my Publix order and we are doing the kung pao chicken we won't use all of this we'll just use three or four chicken breasts whatever we need for that and then we will just freeze the rest I got some more of my Olay Extreme Wellness Wraps. Y'all know I use those all the time for my pizzas. Charlie got some of the salsa con queso, th the Tostitos. Normally he likes to get some that's got some different ones, but there wasn't anything that he liked there, so he just got all of the cheese. I did go ahead and get another pineapple while I was there. Their pineapples and stuff are usually much better than what we can get at Kroger and stuff, and it should be good for next week, so that's something I won't have to get next week. We got paper bowls and some paper plates back there. I do use those frequently. Um, we got the cats, some Temptations treats, and the dogs, their dentist sticks. If you know, we have five animals. We have three cats and two puppies, so we always need lots of treats. I got some more of this uh, McCormick Girl Mates Montreal Steak Seasoning. I love to use this on um, something like this Broccoli Normandy and just roast it in the oven and put a generous... Uh, helping of that steak seasoning on here and it makes these really good but it is spicy so if you don't like spicy stuff you wouldn't like it but i love it picked up this vegetable medley we are going to use this for our stir fry vegetables this isn't necessarily my favorite choice i actually prefer the walmart one but i just don't like to get anything that has the uh baby corns in it i'm one of those that does not like baby corn and the one that actually was the um, stir fry medley that they had there had the baby corn so we just went with this one so it's just uh broccoli green beans carrots red peppers wax beans and yellow pepper so i think that will be fine we will season that up with the uh, kung pao seasoning as well i got the omeprazole i did have to take this daily since i had my weight loss surgery that is something that it's just part of my daily routine and it's super cheap to get it at sam's club we got another pack of coffee this is the coffee that we use it's actually really good if y'all have never tried that uh, charlie got some of his pop tarts he takes one of those to work every day for his morning snack He's not working this week, but he will need them once he goes back after the first of the year. Uh, we just picked up some more salt and then some more pepper, which I do like this organic blend, this Members Mark pepper. It's really good. We do have like the ground salt and then we also have some sea salt that we use, but we also just needed some regular salt. Of course, my dog's over here coughing and hacking. Sorry if you heard that. She always has to do something every time that I'm videoing. And then we just got some more OxyClean, and I got another one of my big box of Fiber One Brownies. I have one of those every day for snack. And then Charlie made a mistake. I sent him over there to get me some pistachios, and I didn't even look at them, but he got the ones that are lightly salted. So these are trash. So these actually have to go back because I only like the salt and pepper ones. So tomorrow he gets to make a run to Sam's Club and do an exchange. So he's so excited about that. And then I just got another pack of my Oscar Mayer bacon. You know, I have this every morning for breakfast, and I will freeze these. These freeze fine, and then once I'm ready for another pack, I just take it out of the freezer and just let it de-thaw overnight, and it is perfectly good to go. And I think that is all of the haul. It doesn't seem like a lot, but we did spend over $300. But the three bags of cat litter and the waters... And the paper towels and all of that stuff that does add up over time so we try to just go to sam's club and do a haul once a month but anyway that's what we got and we are ready for our meal prep tomorrow i think we have everything we need hey guys thank you so much for watching my video today i do appreciate each and every one of y'all if you are new to my channel go ahead and click that subscribe button down below and that notification bell so that you don't miss any time that i upload i usually upload on tuesdays thursdays and on sunday so uh, again, I appreciate y'all and thank you for joining me and hit that like button. I love y'all and I will see you in the next video. I know that I told you we're over. I swear that I'm sober. Just listen.